Tens of thousands of people have been ordered to evacuate the areas downstream of the tallest dam in the United States. Abrupt orders were issued to rural communities along the Feather River amid fears that a damaged auxiliary spillway adjacent to the dam is on the verge of collapse. Authorities are releasing water to lower the lake's level. Built in the 1960s, the Oroville Dam lies about 240 kilometers northeast of San Francisco. It is just upstream of Oroville, a city of 16,000 people, and stands at 230 meters high. If that is not addressed and we don't take care of that and mitigate it properly, essentially what we're looking at is approximately a 30-foot wall of water that would be coming out of the lake. Not the lake draining, but a 30-foot wall of water. That is why we took the appropriate measures that we did, and the sheriff did, and implemented the evacuation uh, process that, that we had going. Weeks of heavy rain had left Lake Oroville nearly full. However, relief over the end of a devastating four-year drought in California was short-lived after engineers realized that the spillway's damaged condition was not fit to deal with the lake at capacity. Helicopters began dropping boulders onto the spillway in an attempt to plug the gap as authorities try to prevent disaster.